Welcome back to my shop. My name is Brian and Mark is in the, in the background. Finally back in the shop too. <laughs> in this video, we're going to make this zero cote and birch plywood hand plane. We had the plywood laying around the shop. We also had the three eighths of veneers we cut a few years back. We didn't know what to do with them. So we decided to do a tool build series incorporating the zero cote and all the tools. Um, in this plane, we used a Lee Valley Veritas uh, Nora style adjuster. I'll leave a link down below where you can get it. And if you look here, this isn't a missed drill on both sides. We put Allen set screws to keep this uh, blade tracking straight down in the plane. So if you want to see how we build this, stick around.
F-ups happen everywhere. And I definitely effed up this one. I spent all this time making this body. And when I did the outline to cut the shape, I totally forgot about the mechanism for the, the blade adjuster. Um, not a total failure yet. I did have half the cap still, so it was able to screw it down. So I'm thinking I might be able to save this, maybe take a piece of the body I cut off and glue it up behind there. You know, just, just enough to cover from here to here. Um, so I'm gonna continue on with this and um, watch yourself in the base. Guys, disaster averted. We were able to save this. I made this little bump up here for the uh, mount for the adjuster. So we were able to finish this. Um, thought this was going to be um, firewood, but uh, we made it through. Uh, now we're going to finish it. So we got to take it down again, and we're going to uh, do something a little different. Rather than just putting a finish on it, this uh, zero coat is very very grainy, um, and I want this thing to look as slick as possible. So you know, the old fashioned way would be, you know, put oil on it, wet sand it, make a slurry, scrape it down, and sand it when you're done. You know, that's all the pores, and then you finish it. Um, nice people at Aquacoat. I'll leave a link down below uh, how you can uh, get this stuff. Um, they sent me a sample to try it out. Now, I do have planned a video uh, extensively on how to use this, so I'm not really going to go into it in too much detail here. And I also have a uh, Walnut coffee table build planned that we're going to use this on. That should make it uh, like a glass top finish. So, without any further ado, let's get back to this thing. Let's get it finished.
guys, that's gonna wrap it. There she is. She's a thing of beauty. Zero Cote and Birch Ply. With the Nora style adjuster, it was a kit I bought from Veritas. I'll leave a link down below to it. You can see it's nice and slick. That's the aqua coat that we used. It filled in the green. We did two coats. Uh, you should really do three or four, but it's not on the tabletop. And I don't want it too slippery. I want to be able to hold on to it. And she is cutting. It needs a little more tuning. Uh, the chips are getting stuck, so I gotta open something up there to make them fall a little bit better. But we're already, we are, yeah, we're already cutting with them. So pretty cool. I hope you guys enjoyed that process of making this hand plane. If this is your first time to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And if you like this video, share it with your friends. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Cut some more.